Good evening, scholars and friends. It's time for tonight's bedtime story. Tonight, I will be reading Short or Tall, Doesn't Matter at All by Asif Rosanis. Not too far away from here, in a small town, there lived a little girl who never frowned. Mia always wanted to play. She was the highlight of everyone's day. Mia was just like all the other kids. She was a regular girl, except for a few bits. The other kids at school were tall and she was different from them all. Mia studied hard and was one of the best, but she was shorter than the rest. Mia's classmates laughed and mocked her almost every day. They were never careful of what they say. That often made Mia sad, so she decided to tell her dad. She knew she didn't have to worry, so he told her a story. At noon, the sun was being mean. He said he was the tallest thing anyone has ever seen. He said to the moon, I'm taller than you. You'll never be as tall as me. You know that's true. But time went by and at sunset, the sun wasn't that high. The moon told him he shouldn't boast but it doesn't matter who's tallest or knows the most. It's important to be friendly and nice. They became friends and the son took her advice. Mia learned to be good and polite. She understood there were things more important than height. During break, the next day, all the kids went out to play. They wanted to play basketball, but they didn't invite Mia because she was small. One of the kids threw a ball and it started to roll. It rolled away and fell in a small hole. The kids couldn't reach it, but everyone wanted to try. They would just hit their heads and cry. All of them took a turn, but they were too tall. The kids needed someone brave, skinny, and small. Mia saw them scratching their heads and wandering about. She wanted to help and get their ball out. The little girl got the ball she squeezed through. They cheered and said, Mia, do you want to play too? The kids were amazed by her dribble and aim, so she showed them some moves they could use in the game. The children were all very happy and excited. To have such a good friend, they were indeed delighted. They didn't care that Mia was short. They were very happy to have someone to have fun with, help and support. Mia was such a good friend, they would have never guessed. That is why having a big heart is the best. Friends are friends, whether you're big or small. They will always be there for you to call. Because at the end of the day, being short or tall, as even the sun and moon know now, it just doesn't matter at all.
The end. Good night.